Hey guys, it's Vita Day number two, and I'm eating Pizza Hut, and I'm watching, I'm always binge watching some YouTube video, but I'm binge watching Evelyn from the internet is actually the girl that I referred to yesterday. Um, yeah, and she's really hilarious, and she's talking about, this is the video, Greek yogurt is not ice cream, because it's not. Don't lie to yourself. And I'm also simultaneously binge watching <laughs> Jessica from Jessica Peace Love Books uh, from her March wrap up. So excitement. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys after I'm done and actually doing something. And later on in this video, you'll probably see me um, review To the Stars by Molly Mac Adams. So that's going to be super duper fun. And um, yeah, okay. I'll see you guys later. And that's when I'll probably end the actual vlog ish video. Okay, bye. Okay, hey y'all. I'm back again, and I'm going to be doing a book review of Two of Stars by Molly Mae Adams. Now, this book is about a girl, Harlow, who is 15, and Knox Alexander, who is 18 at the beginning of this book. And um, Knox makes a wish or promise to her that he will wait for her, or essentially to wait till she's 18 so they can actually officially date. But on her 18th birthday, his heart gets is broken because she says that I did not wait for you. And because she kind of fell in love with this, this guy, who she later realizes is a, is a monster. And there is a, there's a trigger warning for a domestic abuse and abuse and you know, marriages. So if you, is that a trigger warning for you, I would not advise you read this. Go far away. There are other Malmé Adams books you can read. But, yeah, I would do that, okay? And so, there's a lot of factors that will, that will that are keeping them from being with each other. So, Knox, you know, being wise, saying, hey, I'm going to wait for you because you're a beautiful girl. I'm a handsome dude. You know, all this. We're attracted to each other, so we need to, like, chill. So, it was wise of him, his part to do that. But then by the time she got her life together, her feelings together, she actually... Fell in love with this guy, her current husband, Collins, who is abusive. And it, I literally wanted him to die. I literally wanted him to die the first five pages. He just ticked me off. How I was raised, you do not put a, your hand on a woman. If you are a man, you do not. In this society now, people, I mean, men are being bold. And I'm just like, excuse you like did your mama teach you manners and then you have to also figure out you know kind of think about their background but that does not give you, you an excuse to abuse somebody i don't care what who or what you came from that is, does not give you an excuse to put your hand on somebody and hurt them why and i just wanted i just I, oh lord i just wanted her to get away from this man this crazy psychotic man. this man was crazy i felt like i was reading it i was reading an element movie but like literally a screenplay of an element movie because these fool this fool was crazy and i just love knox's protectiveness of harlow when because he knew something was wrong he's loved this girl for years and he knew something was wrong and i'm just like Lord have mercy. It hit me in the feels. And I was like, okay, this is the one book Mama and I'm not gonna give me on. <laughs> Spoiler. <laughs> she did. And I oh my god, I love Knox and Hollow together, despite the many factors of um people not wanting to be together because of their age difference. And I love Harlow's strength of her leaving, needing wanting to leave the relationship because she knew it was bad. She knew it was bad, so she wanted to leave. And she figured out a, a safe haven in Knox. And I just loved everything about them. They were so beautiful together. And I was just it just made me happy. And my wish came true. That's all I'm gonna say. But anywho, I'll write this in 8 out of 10 stars, and I hope you guys enjoyed this book. And I will see you guys on the video today, number 3. Bye! Before my camera shuts off once again.